Well, we begin with developing news out of Palmdale, where a standoff that started with the deputy involved shooting just came to an end a short time ago. Now, it all started around 930 last night on Carling Place, just east of 40th Street, and that's where KKL 9's Lori Perez is there, live with the latest developments for us. Lori. Amy, yeah, that long night would likely now turn into a very long day as deputies have confirmed that a man who had been barricaded inside a home is now dead after a second deputy involved shooting early this morning. The place where it happened, Carling Place, is now completely blocked off and will remain that way as homicide detectives will now take over the investigation. Deputies spent hours trying to communicate to reason with the man as he was inside a home. Sky 9 was overhead as this was just starting to unfold. And there was special concern because they say the man went into his home after first exchanging fire with deputies just after nine last night. They first responded to a call for service. When deputies say a deputy and the man both fired shots. Now, at that time, they told us no one was hurt, no deputy was hurt. They did not believe the man was hurt. And deputies say the man then ran back into his house. The sheriff's department immediately closed off the street. There are lots of homes here. We can see a lot of streets, uh, cars parked on. The street, so a lot of people around. And so that was a big concern because uh, he was armed, and that meant he could be a danger to other people. He could also be a danger to himself. You can see there's lots of deputies still on the scene here. And early this morning, again, we're told there was that second deputy involved shooting. We're told uh, the man did fire at deputies at that time, and he is now deceased. We do not have his identity, and we don't know yet what led to the initial call to this neighborhood. Those are all. Uh, uh, questions that we hope to get answered throughout the day. For now, we're live in Palmdale. Amy, back to you.